a boy, a ball, and a dream. This is the story of one young man's journey against incredible odds to fulfill a lifelong goal on a local high school basketball court. Having to prevail over a learning disability, in addition to painful physical setbacks, Kevin Garcia's lifelong dream of playing in a varsity basketball game did not come without trials. We found out he had scoliosis in, in middle school, and we went to doctors, to specialists, and then after surgery, Kevin has like 22 bolts in his back. The doctor said he's, he's allowed to play. He practiced, practiced. We signed him up for school and we just wanted to get him accustomed to some sports which not too dangerous and he can relate to it. Kevin is a special needs student but you wouldn't know that from looking at him and you couldn't ask for you know to have a better friend or a better student. His sprouting love for basketball as well as a persevering attitude set Kevin on his path for accomplishment. Uh, Kevin tried to blend in with the other kids. At one point he didn't know exactly what to do, but he kept saying, you know, he's going to try. Just so happened two years ago, a teacher came to me and said they had a kid that wanted to try out for basketball. Trials came out and that Kevin showed up, so I treated him no different than anybody else. You know, he had to run just like everybody else and, and go through the process. So we ended up keeping him and um, putting him on the JV team. Well, when we, he found out he did not make varsity, he, that's all he said all year. Mom, I need to better my skills to play in varsity. First, I didn't know his grade, you know, as far as, but I knew his age. And, you know, with FHSA standards, you know, you can only play between your 19. And, I, and it just came out that this would be his senior year. You know, that was like two weeks before the end of the season and the decision was made then, you know, to, to address him. Coach Lewis came to me with the idea to give Kevin a jersey, and I told him I would. Well, knowing Isaiah and his character, you know, sense of humor, um, you know, he's pretty much adjustable to anything, and with it being Kevin, you know, he really didn't have a problem with it. And in the locker room, I gave him my jersey, and he started cheering. Because he was, he was so happy. I feel I feel happy because Coach Lewis was like, oh, Kevin needs a jersey and put it on. And I was like, oh, I want to be on the court. And I was like, all right, I'm ready. He was going to play, you know, regardless what the score was. As soon as Kevin, you know, stepped on the floor, everybody started cheering. Everybody in the stands got up. They started clapping. They started cheering. He brought him into the game, you know, told him to go to the table. Here comes the crowd. You know, Kevin, Kevin. He just sets up a three-point line right by the bench. So we're just like, come on, Kevin, you can hit this, you can hit this. And I remember um, Matt just passing him the ball, and he'd just take a shot, he missed. Then we got rebound. We were getting offensive rebounds, giving it right back, and he just kept shooting. I think he shot like five shots, just kept missing them all. He shot just five, six shots. He missed, 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 and the time is running down. Maybe a minute left on the clock. I had to call a timeout. So we gave it to him at the other end of the court, and he brought it all the way down the half court, and they fouled him. I knew once he got to the free throw line, I was pretty sure he was going to knock him down. I know Kevin, you know, he works hard for this. I know he wants that point, so he was just going to get it. There's no words to describe it. The crowd went wild. I mean, you had people that had their phones out, cameras out, was recording it. Um, and the crowd just went nuts. I mean, they were just all cheering. Even the other team was cheering for Kevin. He was like in cloud nine. Mom, I played. I got to play that varsity. Mom, I got to play. I'm, I missed some shots, Mom, but I got to play. I got to play. No one expected Kevin to score points in a varsity game. And for Kevin to just continue to be steadfast and, and push forward and work hard and actually make the breakthrough that he did, you know, that it, it speaks volumes for what you can do if you just work hard and continue to try. Yeah, it was awesome. I just like when they come up and give me a high five and um, give me a hug. For his courage, passion, commitment, and never give up attitude, we salute Kevin Garcia, his teammates, and coaches for this special night when a boy with a ball led to a dream come true.